sitting here on a rather fine new hydraulic windlass on the Baltic trading galleass Johanna, now called the Ciudad de Badalona. Uh, this ship was the boat on which I met my wife in 1969 and on which I sailed to Madeira and had all manner of adventures with my old shipmate John who is currently holding a rain guard over the camera to keep Roz, who is taking the pictures, dry and the lens of the camera dry. It's a filthy old day and it's rotten really because we've come all the way down to Barcelona having discovered that this ship has been saved. We last saw this vessel, well I last saw her sailing out of Madeira in 1970 in the winter time. John stepped off her in the West Indies and never saw her again and we'd no idea what happened to her. It could have been anything. But actually, she had a short career in the West Indies as an island trader, we think, but we're not really certain. But then she was bought by the famous cruising yachtsman Edward Alcard, who wrote a number of books, and his wife Claire wrote a great book all about their adventures on the boat. And we were sort of dimly aware of all this. Then we got hold of Claire's book and read it, and were very excited. And it was only when I produced my book in the wake of Heroes, which featured Edward Alcard, that we thought we should get in touch with him just to clear copyright on Edward's work, really. And it turned out that the boat was in good hands down here with these excellent Catalan people, and she's just looking so smart. She looks so much smarter than ever she did in our time. John and I were talking about her just now, and we said, really, it was a miracle that we ever got her to sea at all, because when we found her, she'd been lying in the mud in Livington for years and years and years, and uh, she was in a terrible state. Um, the masts were all over the deck, and there were still trees. Nobody had built the masts. It was, it was desperate. But the boat was in wonderful original condition then. She had her old engine, the old hot bulb diesel, bonk, 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 just as she'd had when she was trading in Denmark. And she's had so many lives, this boat, it's a wonderful thing to be honoured, to feel the history of her washing all over you. So here I am, signing off in the Mediterranean Sea in a good old English Channel day, on the boat that really formed the man that I am. Fair winds, mates. I hope it's a better day than this.